So in a minute we're going to be doing the emergency stop. Okay. I'm going to say stop and I would like you to stop as if it's an emergency. Okay. Before you stop I will obviously look around for you mm -hmm. and make sure that there is no one behind us. If there is, we won't be doing this uh, manoeuvre and then I'll try and find another safe place to do it. Do I still look to make sure there's no one when you say stop? Uh, no. Okay. Because in an emergency, think of it like this, a child has just run in front of you. Okay. You don't have time. Now, as a driver who checks their mirrors frequently, you will know what's behind you anyway. Yeah. Um, but in the exam, when you're doing this, the examiner will say stop. now. Once you've stopped the car, remember, don't kill the car, just do it as if it's an emergency. So firm braking, mm -hmm. where imagine you have uh, something behind you like a bag or a rack sack, and that should shunt forward. Okay. So the force should be uh, firm enough that it shunts forward. Okay. Now, once you've stopped the car, what are you going to be doing? Probably restarting it. Uh, no. When you say restart, are you anticipating your car stalling? Probably. No, because uh, what are we meant to do with the foot brake? Clutch. And brake, brake and clutch. Yeah. So we press the brake and then at the same time, just after you've pressed the brake, uh, you press the clutch down to the floor like yeah. you do in a normal stop, but you increase the braking uh, on, your, on your right foot. Once the car has fully stopped, we put the handbrake, we put it in neutral and then what do we do? First and then... Wait, what do you mean? So Once you... you've stopped the car in yeah. the middle of the road, what are you going to do? You're going to put it in first gear. And go away. Drive. Okay, so yeah. two things that was a mistake in what you said. Once you've stopped the car, mm. we need to do a 360 observation. Okay. So we start from our left shoulder, finish to our right, to make sure that we are aware of our surrounding. Mm -hmm. Then the examiner tells you to move off. You do another 360. Okay. If necessary, you give a signal and then you go and do it. Okay. Yeah, so let's have an attempt at it and see how it goes. Drive normally as you would. Don't try and anticipate when I'm going to tell you to do it. You just drive and I will do the rest for you. So I didn't get a chance to do it here mm -hmm. because the car came. So continue, we'll go to another road okay. and then we'll do it. So uh, we're doing a turn left, please. So keep going, we're going to try on this road. So.
my feet both went on the same pedal. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Not a problem. So we're going to start again. So just start the car. Remember, the mistake you're making is this: yeah. is that you're panicking to start off with, yeah. and you're pressing both. Well, obviously your feet went on. Yeah. yeah. So remember this: you're going to brake firm, like okay. on the brake first, and then clutch down, and then increase more of the brake. Okay. That's all you got to do. Get ready. Let's move on. We'll try and find another road because it's not a question of stop the car and that's it no yeah. you don't what's the problem with um, actually stalling the car if there's turn, people right? behind me it's... no no remember if you stall the car what happens to your electronics sure it damages it forget about damage but do you have control of your steering wheel no because how did the steering wheel feel was it hard or soft just focused on my feet I didn't okay so the steering wheel you would lose power to the power steering mm -hmm. so if you lose power to the power steering you can't steer if you need to so this is why you've got to brake and clutch immediately yes. so keep going I'm gonna go ahead and that's a giveaway Slow. No, no, relax. Remember, what do we do after that? Neutral. Mm -hmm. Good. And then move off when it's safe to do so. Okay. That's it. Was well that done. too slow? No, no, that was too not slow. too slow. No. Okay. Remember, your speed is going to be round where we are. We're not really going to get any 30s, are we? It's going to be a side road where the speed's not going to be above 20. So you don't need to kill the brakes too much. Mm. You're just firm braking like you would imagine there's a pedestrian in front of you. And that's it. No, don't worry about that. That's fine. Okay, so we we'll, won't we'll ask you to do that again. 